And for our live coverage, we find ourselves in Donetsk at the Donbass Arena. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It is Shakhtar Donetsk facing Porto. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4 5 1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. And a look at the starting lineup for Porto. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. Thank you, Don Vassarina. Enjoy today's game. And the match begins. Well, a good tackle. Taremi. Good work from Porto to win it back. Oh, the threat is there. Just made sure nothing came of that. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box. Clever oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. And the ball is loose. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. Space afforded him. Totovitsky, tremendous block. Very quick thinking there. Evan Nilsson. Oh, in with a chance. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, here we can see just how good this goal is. It has everything. Skill, pace and power. There was no stopping him there. And back underway. 1-0 it is. So. Alexander Zubkov in the right place to cut out the pass. A room to roam on the wing. 
Now he must favour the cross. And he takes on the shot. Superb block. Totovitsky. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. He's going forward well here. And fed forwards. Well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Chance here. Can he finish? They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal. So 2-0 now. Totovitsky. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Well, Porto have certainly tried to control the flow of the game. As those stats confirm, yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Oh, hang on, Stuart, look at this! Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Opportunity here, and a goal! They're running riot here, almost out of sight! Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Alexander Zubkov. Oh, he's given the ball away. Uribe. Makes the move to the inside. Is this the moment? Oh, keeper dealt with it. A short corner, let's see. He might be able to carve something out. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. Well, they couldn't keep it. Alexander Zubkov. Well, possession seeded. Now can they counter clinically? Mateo Suribe. Really vital interception here.
Eustachio. Wendell. Oh, big opportunity. Still alive. Will he? A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's making his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he's looked unstoppable today. Quick, clever, skillful, and he's taken his goals really well. He's been wonderful to watch. Underway in the second half. And after such a lopsided first 45 minutes, is it possible to think they could turn this around? Stepanenko. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Wendell. Mateo Suribe. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. Lassina Traore. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Fabio Cardoso. Eustachio. Oh, nice ball. Mehdi Karami. Wendell. But it will not stand offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. On you go, says the referee. Advantage. Can he finish? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. Time for a change then. And over comes the corner. Well, no mistake from the keeper acting decisively. Traore. Totovitsky. Nicely timed tackle. And using his body to good effect. Eva Nilsson. Galeno. Mehdi Karami. Precise ball movement. 
It's a weighted pass. Terrific piece of anticipation. And that puts them in position. Stepanenko. Andriy Todovitsky. Determined defending. 20 minutes remaining. Can they hit on the break? This looks promising. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Lassina Traore. This looks interesting. Stepanenko. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. A glorious chance. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Now can they counter clinically? Traore. Chance to finish. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And time for the change now. And over it comes. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, opting for the short corner. Bogdan Mikhailichenko. Well, closed down straight away. That'll be a Porto throw in. Well, the final whistle approaching, and this has certainly been an away day to remember. Stuart, your assessment? Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. And the counter looks on here, options available. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And now, passing it through. Oh, but just unable to unlock the defence. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? 
he was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today. Chance here. Can he finish? They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Opportunity here. And a goal! They're running riot here, almost out of sight. Still alive. Will he? A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. <laughs> 